Hey folks, I'm Surveying Glory and welcome to a new campaign in Europa Universalis 4. I have never set out to try for any of the EU4 achievements before, so I've decided to give that a go and I'm going to start off with the African Power Achievement. So we'll be playing as Congo and I also need to be in Iron Man mode. And let's go. So I'm going to, before I get into the game, I'm going to check the settings just to make sure that the sound isn't overpowering. I'll give that a go. I think it's okay. Right. So playing as a fetishist nation and I plan to try and stay fetishist through the campaign and we'll go I think from discipline to start with the first ruler because we're going to be at war a fair bit uh, so we'll do that and deal with advisors later we don't have the money for them right now let's see if cogs probably want to use them eventually so most we'll them for now and some light ships send you up to protect trade at the Ivory Coast and then we'll try privateering as well we'll see which is the best for us uh, so we're making just over a ducat per month with the army at full maintenance uh, we don't have any forts other than the capital fort. Okay. At the moment we have a spearman, I think. We can go to clubmen. Just want as much offensive shock and morale as I can get. No advisors, 233 ruler, 162 air. No possible rivals, okay. But we do have vassals. Okay. Right, to start with, then let's get a royal marriage with these guys. And I want to get some sort of alliance over here somewhere. Somewhere that we can begin to eat up these other areas. CB Yaka there, uh, This is Linda here so They're rivaled with Linda Rivaled with Kazembe That's Kazembe Okay, so they're rivals Conja, Chocolate and Linda, so that's those two. Kalundwe, Kikonja and Kuba. I think I like Kikonja as an ally. Chocolate and Linda. So that gives me, if I take Yaka, and then we can start to get some provinces in here in Kikonja's name, that'd be good. And if I fabricate in Kuba, 
it gets me to Kalundwe. Kikonja is good for moving in these places. I think that's what we're going to do. Uh, can we get an alliance? Not quite. Damn it. Hmm. Let's commit to a royal marriage anyway. Do I want to go over the vassal limit? I think we get vassal limit of three. Did it say? Yeah. Or a diplomatic relations limit. So we get two vassals, an ally over here, and if I can make uh, Nziku or Teo a vassal as well. Or I could just leave them and take them later on. We might do that. Uh, what else do I still have to do? Don't have fleets and their armies. Uh, merchants. Let's collect from trade there. And we've got somebody collecting at the Ivory Coast. I don't have range to get anywhere else, so that's that then. We don't have much power up here, but once we've eaten up these guys, we have a bit more. Okay, so that's an estuary. Get moving then. We have a royal marriages, a good queen. Now that these guys are back, let's start fabricating up here. We're building a spine network anyway. as well, or Kasanji, and then we can feed some territory to this guy. So again, build spine network in there. And I've got missions, I've not checked out our missions. Okay, total army size at least 10% of force limit, it should be achievable. These two countries in alliance with Congo, and 150 opinion. They come with 7.78 currently, 5.18, so that should be okay. If it must be true, all of must be true. We are the leading producer of slaves. There's producing provinces at least four. We modify the abolition of slavery act. Less slaves producing provinces than one. Maybe a country. Okay. Um. This one gives us morale of armies, land maintenance modifier. Well, there we go. That's a no brainer then. What is our limit? So we need three more units. And this army is eight and two. We'll just go for infantry then, I think. Let's uh, do it. This is we. We'll move you into there. I remember what I also meant to do. Estates. <clears throat> you give me a generalship. That'd be up at seventy-three influence. That's fine. That also improves that.
want to take the military power. Recovery speed, land maintenance modifier would go up by 10%. I think we'll not bother with that right now. And here, um, this requires influence of 25 or greater. So if we grant Monopoly Charters, we're going to pick up prestige when we go to war. So let's do that. Development cost goes down trade efficiency, that's good. And that put down to 45. About 50 diplo power, let's take it. And up here, again. There's more prestige and legitimacy. Mm, yep, let's do it. So if she went down, tax modifier would stay up. Stability cost. If I'm going to no CV, I'd rather keep the stability cost for now. So leave that and we'll come back for the admin support later. And how things look down here, you, you're wrong marriage with us, and you would ally now, uh, 12th December, I bet you, you ally with somebody before we can do that. <clears throat> so you were going to be my target, improving relations with Yaka, no, with, oh, Ndongo. That's my vassal. Improving relations with you. King Nkuwe is now careful. Good. Aggressive expansion impact comes down. We're now up to 1.67 ducats per month. And... Improving opinion. We won't get away with this yet. Let's offer an alliance. Do I definitely want to go with Kukonja? You're allied with Kalundwe, that's them. You're allied with Lunda and Kalundwe, it's them. You're allied with Teo, excellent. That lets me take them as well. And you, Kasanji. That's Kasanji there, this is Kikonja. That's right. Okay, that's us. Let's offer an alliance. Good stuff. Perfect. Now, I meant to look and see what do we get from trade? 1.27. So this, uh, no, it's the wrong screen. No, it's not the wrong screen, it's the right screen. What do we get? From protecting trade. That doesn't tell me there. Ivory Coast. From light ships we get plus 12 trade power. Ah, right, okay. Let's have a look. Well, we get 0.57. Easiest way to do it, I suppose, then is to switch your mission. Privateer, Ivory Coast. We're making 1.67 and we get 0.57 from trade up here. And 
and now so it's gone down by 0.26 spoils of ore get 0.23 so it's just about the same um it's not really worth one way over another so just leave that there what's our fleet limit we can get another ship Oh, I'll do that once we've got some more money. Yaka, you're now allied with Kasanji. Uh, that's fine. You can live with that. I'm essentially just waiting for the units here to get up to full strength again. And we have our leader. Yeah, it was not that good. But we've completed this mission so we get extra morale and reduced land maintenance modifier. Okay. Uh, let's go and hit Yaka then. we should be able to deal with and Kasanji should be able to deal with as well right declare war no CB we're coming in Kikonja I don't need to do I think so we'll go for that and just get back up to minus one while we can. You march in there. I'm not even on the third of March. Um, there you go, you're in the war. So let's have Loango go in there and Ndongo go in there. I also want to think about these guys, let's have you focus on Siege. Right, so you catch them, wipe them. Good. You're heading in there. Let's detach a couple of units you head back there you split one off to go in there you're sieging down that's great and you're sieging as well that's good 6th of April you're in the 2nd you're in the 11th too late but uh, hopefully we'll be okay. Come on, do it, do it, do it, do it, do it. Just fantastic. Okay, Kasanji, I want Ndongo to focus on there. You're still sieging down that, that bit, that's fine. We're heading into Bamba. What's going on there? Thought you'd have been a stack wipe for sure. You keep falling me down. Oh, come on, take these guys. Where are you going? There's a stack right this time. We might get into Kasanji as quickly as we can. Nobility demands stricter sumptuary laws. 
Expensive clothes, great banquets and impressive palaces are some of the most visible symbols of the nobility, but the degree to which one family has money to spend on such things can vary greatly. Uh, bend to the wishes of the nobility. We lose 10% trade efficiency. Nobility gets 10 influence. Can't have that because that put you above 80. Refuse to be the nobility. Nobility loses 20 loyalty, going down to 30. Lose 10 influence, going down to 63. And the merchant guild gains 10 influence, going up to 30. Okay. Caldiet would give them back 15 loyalty and put their influence back up. Damn. Okay, I don't want their influence going up right now. Provincial unrest in some areas. That's okay. You get in there since they're sieging down Yaka, which I suppose is fine. of July, and then the 5th will wipe you out. Okay, and you head up to there. And split off a unit, to, to there. And you come down here. That looks a bit lucky. Going into Yaka. Okay. Let's put you back up here, do a bit of looting. And you split off them to win their help. And let's get rid of our calf. Send you back in here. So it's still not enough. Proceed. So again, split off another unit. Go back into the capital. <clears throat> okay, so we're making a wee bit of money from these provinces. And we're almost breaking even as well. There we go, back up into the positives. What's happening over here? You're now allied with Uba and Cuba as well. That's not so good. Hmm. Well, I guess I just need to fight you when it comes to that. Um, okay, I need another 15. Six, six, okay. Almost reach up here. And you don't have enough to see that siege through. Let's detach them. Put them up there. And hopefully that'll put them over the top. Lunda declared war in Yaka. Okay, if you like. Linda is those guys. Well, there we go, we've just taken Yaka. Uh, let's transfer this to Ndongo. 
And we've taken that as well. Which, oh, it's already done. Nothing left to loot. There's still stuff in here. So from Yaka, yeah, you betcha. Right, so that's us. Okay. Transfer that to Lango. <clears throat> Super peace. Take you and all your cash. Okay. Kasanji. Sue for peace. I'll take Malum. It goes to Ndongo. Take your cash. And no, offer tribute. Treaties. I want war reps, trade power. And give up your alliance with Cuba. And that'll do, I think. Fine. Oh, that's all black flagged. Let's start pulling you all out. You can sue for peace in here. Take both and all your cash. Coalition, Yak is not going to exist. Kuba, Linda, Kasanji. That's all fine. We should be able to handle them if they were to form a coalition and come after me. Aggressive expansion. Yeah, we can deal with that, I think. Okay. Let's get armies back here. Yaka. Let's increase autonomy. And do the same there. And you should be able to call them both. No. Nope. Ah, oh, 90. I should have gone for that one first. <clears throat> But don't want to do that first, I think I probably do. Living disaster, peasants war, stability is less than one. <clears throat> okay. back together. Okay, so you're all over the place. Agricultural revolution. We have managed to increase our agricultural production by implementing new farming techniques for plantations. Uh, Mbata. Take the extra manpower. Up here, fabricate or claim on uh, Nunu, I suppose. And Shinji is our next one. And actually, I can't get any further than that, so yeah, let's pull you back. I can leave you there because we can claim, get a claim on Manini soon enough. And four things here. 
Let's improve relations. A long way from being a vassal. Okay. Third spy network in here. We've got Clayman and, and Paso. United with Kikonja. And that's all. We wait a few months so that we've got a claim on the two provinces. Shinji. We've got a truce with you. And you don't have any alliances because we forced you to break that one. You're allied with Chokwe and Kazembe. Okay. <clears throat> well, fairly successful first episode, I think. So we'll put a break in here. And when we come back in the next part, we'll be going for Cuba. Allied with, our, allied with our allies. So, hope you've enjoyed this. Thanks very much for watching. Uh, please leave me a comment, rate the video. Uh, if you've got any tips on how to succeed in the African Power Achievement, please do leave them below. Uh, and I hope to see you again for part two. Cheers.